Hello everyone and welcome for today's video tutorial. In this video, we will learn how to use Google Analytics for heat map tracking. To get started, first we need to have an account on Google Analytics. For you to understand on how to set up a Google Analytics account, you can watch our previous videos about Google Analytics. Now that we have our Google Analytics account, so we will go to report. Then as you can see here, when we talk about heat map tracking, heat, website heat maps help you track visitor behavior visually so you can make your improve your site around your goals. They highlight which site areas people are engaging with, which areas are working, which aren't, and which areas your users are avoiding. Going back to Google Analytics, we can see the different reports provided by Google Analytics. So we have for acquisition, we have for engagement, we have for monetization, we have for retention, and for users, we have demographics and tech. To track our heat map, so we will go to engagement. So we can see here that we have the overview. So as you can see, in engagement, it will show you the average engagement time, the engage session per user, average engagement, then for events, the event count by event name over time, event count by event name, We also have this report for event count total users, event count per users, and total revenue. So for pages and screens, so we have the views by page path and screen class over time, view by page path and screen class, and for retention, we can see our new users and returning users. And that's how you use Google Analytics for heat map tracking. If you like this kind of videos and want to be updated for more, please click like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.